Okay, this is a little test recording with another combination of inputs. I've got a uh, condenser microphone and uh, electroacoustic guitar. So the uh, electroacoustic guitar has got uh, a built in pickup, and I can plug an instrument cable in here, and there's a, a 9 volt battery inside the guitar. Uh, for powering all of that and the condenser microphone is using phantom power out of the recording interface and uh, the recording interface will always send phantom power to both channels at the same time if phantom power is switched on you can see it is I've got the button pressed down and the green lights on and so I've got phantom power to channels 1 and 2 and the instructions say if phantom power is switched on then only plug an instrument cable in if you are certain it is safe to do so. So I guess the best way to find out is to try it and see. So I've got uh, my instrument uh, cable here and um, that plugs into the guitar and the other end of the instrument cable. Just check that uh, the channel's faded down and uh, I've chosen low impedance here. I'm not convinced that uh, it will matter much with uh, a, a pickup inside the guitar, but uh, I think it's a low impedance pickup. And uh, plugging the instrument cable into the center of the combination connector in the back of the recording interface. I'm going to turn the gain up to about 45 or 50 decibels, 50 dB on the scale, if that is to be trusted. And now just going to uh, do a bit of rusty strumming on these rusty old strings just to see how that sounds uh, direct into the recording interface. So, So I'll play that back, see how it sounds. <laughs> 